Scott Peterson, now 51 years old, has consistently proclaimed his innocence since the beginning. The disappearance of his wife, Lacey Peterson, who was eight months pregnant at the time, on the day before Christmas in 2002, sparked a highly publicized and closely monitored murder case. Four months later, the remains of Lassie, 27, and her unborn son, Connor, were discovered in San Francisco Bay in a severely decomposed state. Scott Peterson, Lassie's husband, became the primary suspect in the case after claiming he was out fishing when his pregnant wife went missing. In 2004, he was convicted of two counts of first-degree murder and subsequently sentenced to death row in 2005. However, this sentence was overturned in 2020. Despite Scott's unwavering insistence on his innocence, Lacey's family firmly believes that he is responsible for the deaths of Lassie and Connor. Now, with the assistance of the Los Angeles Innocence Project, Scott is striving for an opportunity to prove his innocence and secure his freedom. December 2002, Lassie Goes Missing On August 9, 1997, Lassie and Scott Peterson got married after meeting at California Polytechnic State University. They were residing in the affluent city of Modesto, California, when Lassie discovered her pregnancy in May 2002. Excited about becoming parents, Lassie began preparing the nursery for their expected son, whom they named Connor. Lacey's life appeared to be filled with happiness until a few days before Christmas. On the evening of December 23, 2002, she had a conversation with her mother, Sharon Rocha, over the phone. Little did Rocha know that it would be the last time she would ever speak to her daughter. The following morning, on December 24, 2002, a neighbor found the couple's dog, Mackenzie, wandering around the neighborhood and returned it to their yard. However, there was no sign of Lassie. Scott, who was 31 years old at the time, claimed to be fishing in San Francisco Bay, approximately 90 miles away from Modesto. January 2003. Amber Frey comes forward. Concerned about Lassie's well-being, her parents dialed 911 at 6 p.m. on December 24, 2002, to report her as missing. In response, the police initiated an extensive search operation within the Modesto area, expressing their suspicions of foul play. Approximately a month later, on January 24, 2003, Amber Frey stepped forward during a police press conference, revealing that she had recently begun a relationship with Scott, who had informed her of being a widower. This revelation occurred around a month prior to Lassie's sudden disappearance. Upon learning about the news coverage surrounding Lassie's case, Amber promptly contacted the authorities and cooperated with the police by secretly recording her conversations with Scott. April 2003, bodies discovered in SF Bay. On April 13, 2003, after a span of four months, a late-term male fetus was found by a couple in the San Francisco Bay. Just a day later, the body of a woman who had been pregnant recently washed up on the shore, approximately one mile from where the baby's body was discovered. Through DNA tests, it was confirmed that these were the remains of Lassie and Connor. Due to severe decomposition, the authorities faced difficulties in determining the cause of death. Moreover, Lassie's body was devoid of both forearms and her head was missing adding to the complexity of the investigation. April 2003. Scott arrested. On April 18, 2003, police arrested Scott, who had dyed his brown hair blonde near a golf course and charged him with two felony counts of murder with premeditation and special circumstances. The prosecution contended that his motive was to collect a $250,000 insurance policy on his wife. November 2004. Conviction. On November 12, 2004,
Peterson was convicted of first-degree murder in Lassie's death and second-degree murder in Connor's death. 2020. Scott's death sentence. Overturned over the years, Scott fought to clear his name, winning two major legal victories in 2020. In August, he was given the chance to face a new penalty phase trial after his death penalty sentence was overturned by California Supreme Court, who cited jury selection errors by the trial judge. August 2021. Scott's sister-in-law claims he's innocent. In 2021, Scott's sister-in-law, Janie Peterson, said on the Today Show that she believes there is evidence showing that Lassie was killed after Christmas Eve 2002. January 2024, LA Innocence Project takes case. The LA Innocence Project has now assumed responsibility for the case. The organization is currently in search of fresh evidence pertaining to Scott's initial trial, asserting that Peterson's state and federal constitutional rights were infringed upon. As reported by ABC News, recently submitted documents, which were obtained by the outlet, state that new evidence now substantiates Mr. Peterson's enduring assertion of innocence and brings forth numerous inquiries regarding the identity of the individuals responsible for abducting and murdering Lassie and Connor.